Hi guys, I'm back with a lip gloss declutter now. Right now, I have a pretty large lip gloss collection, I feel. Um, I mean, honestly, I don't use lip glosses very often, so I just don't feel I need this many. So let's see if I can get rid of any here. Um, I'm hoping I can just get rid of like 5 to 10, that would be good. I'm not too ambitious here because I know a lot of them I want to keep. So let's see how we do. I'm gonna do it in a similar way as I did my lipsticks. I'm gonna pick out the ones I know I want to keep for sure, and I'm also gonna pick out the ones I want to get rid of for sure, and then we'll see the rest of them, like where we stand. So I know I'm gonna keep all of my Buxom lip glosses. They are kind of new to my collection, and I really like them. So let's just pick all of them out. So those ones. And I know I have a repeat. Yes, I think this is it. This is Jane in the color Jane, and I have two of them. They probably just came from different sets, and I haven't touched either, so I think that would be good if I can just give one of them away to you guys. So I will get rid of one of them for sure, and the rest of them I'm gonna keep. So here are four, five, 10, 13 of Buxom lip glosses I'm keeping. All right, so let's see the rest of them. Um, I'm gonna keep this one. I'm currently pinning it. It's from All May. Um, I like it okay, but I mean, I'm pinning it and I really don't have much left now. You can kind of see it. This is where I am. So I'll keep it just because I'm almost done with it. But because I really tested the formula, I know I'm not like the biggest fan of it and they're getting old. So I'm getting rid of my other shade from this line and this is in the color Just Plum. I'll get rid of this one and it's really old. It's probably just gonna go to the trash. This one, I think I'll just get rid of. This is like a really small sample size um, that I got from a subscription box, never touched it. Um, I just don't see myself really using a clear lip gloss. So that one's going and it's brand new so I can give it to someone. Oh, here's another box. Um, I'll keep it for sure. Okay, um, I think I'll keep all of my Estee Lauder ones. I really like those three, but it's a shame that I haven't used them a whole lot. You can see they're pretty much all full. Um, I really want to make a point to use them though, so I'm gonna keep them. And also I'll keep my Laurie Mercier one. This one I really enjoy and I used it a little bit. This is in the color Shrub. Um, it's a nice nudie color, so I'll keep it for now. Uh, this one is still new. Yes, it's still sealed. I haven't opened it. This is my Maybelline Color Elixir. I think I'll just get rid of it. Never tried it, but maybe you guys will like it. I'll keep my two MAC ones. This one, we'll see about it. I'll keep it for now, but it's kind of like a brighter color. I'm not sure if I want to keep it for the long run. Um, but for now, I'll keep them. I think this purple one is also kind of like... I'd be on a fence about it, you know. Um... Yeah, we'll keep them for now. Oh, those three I think I'll get rid of though. <laughs> they are from Maybelline and they're the Color Sensational line. Um, those two are the older packaging. This one is a newer packaging. This newer one, I just don't think I really use this color. So yeah, that one's going. Those two, I use the crap out of them. But yeah, they last forever. I don't know. They haven't turned or anything, but they're so old and I feel I have like similar shades anyways and it's just not really worth it they're just too old so they're going okay this is all that we have left now i'll keep those two those two are brand new they are similar in color yeah they are but i really want to try out the formula like i've never tried any uh, lorac alter ego lip glosses i've heard a lot of good things about it so i want to keep it also i have never tried this marvelous moxie uh, formula so yeah those two i'll keep those ones uh, i don't know actually i think i'll get rid of this l'oreal one i really like this line it's like really nice but when am i gonna ever use it i don't know um is it separating a little bit not really but you can see the color there um i just feel I don't ever reach for it, you know? And it's a little similar to this uh, Estee Lauder one. The Estee Lauder one is a little darker, but spread out, like on the lips, it's probably not that different. And I'm sure I have a dupe of some sort in my Buxom collection probably, and this one is just really, really old, and yeah, I'm gonna let this one go. 
Um, those two butter lip glosses, I think I'll keep them. They're nice, and they're not that old yet, so, yep, I'll keep them. Okay, guys, so I got rid of four eight, so that's not bad at all, and there are three brand new ones that are gonna go into my giveaway. Those five, I think they're just going to the trash. They're not, like, really good. Well, this one I might ask my family because it's in a tube form, so they're pretty sanitary. I'll ask if anyone wants this, but those four, I think they're just going to the trash. So I'm happy with this. Uh, it's pretty good. I mean, I had, like, 30-some lip glosses, and I got rid of eight of them. I said I wanted to get rid of five to ten, which I met my goal, so... Yay! <laughs> so now I'm gonna do my liquid lipsticks. I think this is all of my liquid lipsticks. Uh, <laughs> I only had, I think, nine at the beginning of the year, and now I have so many. Well, apparently most of them are new, so I probably wouldn't get rid of too many. But I know right away there are a few that I know I'm getting rid of. So I'll get rid of... Actually, I'll get rid of this purple one. This is... Um, the infallible lip paints from L'Oreal. I won both of them from the giveaway. I think I'll keep the taupe one. I might try it out, but I don't think I'll use that purple one. Never even opened it, so that one's going into a giveaway pile. Also, I'm getting rid of this uh, Lime Crime sample size liquid lipstick. This is in the color Pink Champagne. Uh, it's just too frosty pink. I don't think I like a shade like that. So that one's going. And I know I'm keeping those few. Um, like I just said, I might try that one, so we'll keep it for sure. And then those two are pretty nudie shades, and one is a little bit more pink and darker than the other. They're not too different in the tube, but you can see kind of a difference on the lips. And they're really small, so I'll keep them. This one is the Sephora birthday gift, and actually this one is really, like those two are really similar in shades, even swatched out. I'll swatch them for you, um, but because they're both like really small, and I do like both of them uh, color-wise, so I think I'll keep both. They're a little bit different formula-wise though. The Lime Crime is like more wet. Um, now looking at it, this one is a lot lighter, huh? But you know what? I'll just keep them. I think I like them enough. And let's just swatch the other Lime Crime. Why not, right? Yeah, this one is like more yellow. Regardless, I like them, so I'll keep them. This is a sample size Melted. Um, I consider it as a liquid lipstick because they're just formula-wise similar. This one is kind of cool-tone pink, but I like it on my lips, so I'll keep it. And this is only a sample size. I've used it for a while, but I know it's gonna last me like forever because there's so much product in it. And I have two brand new um, melted lipsticks. I have one in the uh, metal shade. This is metallic to-do. The other one is melon. Um, I haven't opened them, but I'll keep them for now. All right, um, those ones, I think I'll keep those two because I've used them a ton. I think I'm actually almost done with this one. Uh, this is just the show off line. I love this color. It's so pretty on the lips. Every time I wear it, like I'm impressed by the formula, the color and everything. So I'm hoping I can finish this. Uh, this one is more on the pinky side, but it's very pretty. And for summer, it's, it's very appropriate. So I'll keep those two. Those two from Revlon, they are still both sealed. Um, I'll get rid of this uh, brighter colored one, I think. Um, yeah, this is in the shade Flirtation. Yeah, Flirtation. Yeah, I'll get rid of one, keep one to try out the formula, but yeah, this one's going, this one's keeping. Okay, um, can I get rid of any of my Buxom ones? I think they're all very lovely. I have only tried out this purple one. The other four I haven't touched. Uh, this purple one is is beautiful. I like that color, actually. <laughs> it's very different, intense, but I like it. So, yeah. I think I'll keep them. I'll keep all five of them. Those next ones. Uh, let's see. I've never, like, really worn them, worn them, I don't think. That's a beautiful coralish pink shade. And this one... 
Ooh, that's cool tone. I don't think I'll like that. Um, yeah, I'll get rid of that one. Those two, what's this called? It's called Extreme Shine Lip Cream. I can, ooh, whoa, jeez. Ugh, that's really concealer nude, isn't it? And yeah, I'm not sure about that. Um, this one is cool tone, but like not as bright of a cool tone as that one. So I think I'll get rid of this one. This one is just too concealer nude. I, I don't think it'll look nice on me. So that one is going. This is in the color. What are you? Does it have a color name? Right there. Natural. So that one's going. And I'll keep the one nude peach fuzz. And I'm also keeping this soft matte lip cream. So that's it. I got rid of um, five, which is not bad. Uh, two of them I have used. Those three are new, so they're going into the giveaway. Those two are probably just going to the trash. I know I have had them for a little while, and even though I never really use them, you know what? I'll ask if my family wants them, but otherwise, um, yeah, I'll ask them, or they're going to the trash. So that's it. I think um, I'm pretty happy. Overall, I got rid of a lot of lip products. I feel mentally a lot lighter now, <laughs> which is a good thing. And if you guys enjoyed this, please click like, and I might go tackle my like blushes next, but uh, we'll see about that. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.